Hello everyone, Leslie Ann here. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you're new to my channel, so my name is Leslie Ann and I do mainly lifestyle videos on my channel. Um, we didn't out today, I had to go out um, and so we decided, because we were in the area, to pop into Home Bargains and where else did we go? Chris had to go to Curry's. He popped it into popped into Halfords, had to think then for a minute. Um where else did we go? That might have been it. Um oh no, went into Marks and Spencer's food hall and then went and had a Costa coffee and then came home. Um I will show you the bits and bobs that we've that we picked up today though. there we go that should be okay got your balance but we should be fine um went into jolly's actually i forgot to say that because we needed some more dog food for our dogs um but we got these puppy pads in home bargains i think these were 10 pounds i think uh let's have a look at the receipt that's halfords um i'm sure they were 10 pounds anyway these and um, you've got a hundred of the jumbo extra value puppy pads um a massive big box and a great price i mean i pay about 15.99 in sainsbury's for a hundred so we don't need them yet but we thought we'd get them because the price was so good i've got the b&m receipt here now so i can tell you exactly how much they were they were 10 pounds yeah 10 pounds hello baby girl hello pupils Okay, um, right, these were, let me move you a bit. That's, that's a bit better, isn't it? These were £1.49 each. You've got four in here. The, you know, you get like the little jelly pots with fruit in. Um, pineapple, four of those, and four of the mandarin. And what's good about these is they don't have to go in the fridge. They can just sit in the cupboard, which is brilliant. Um, two of these, if you haven't tried these, these are delicious. They're the Nescafe Gold. They're the Golden Honeycomb Aero Mocha. They are so tasty. Really, really nice. Well, they were £2 each, which isn't bad, really. Um, I got this to make a curry. It's a family value Sharwood's Tikka Masala. So it's a great big one. What have we got in here? 700 and 20 grams so that was three pounds um the Sharwoods mango chutney so the mango chutney was two pounds 29 um picked up this genoa fruit cake thought that looked really nice um I really can't be bothered to make cakes at the moment. What weight have we got in here? I don't know if it says actually. Um, no, it doesn't say, but well, I can't see that it says it anyway. Um, but it is suitable for vegetarians. So it's a nice, sizable, big one. Look, that was how much I paid for that one. That was one pound seventy-nine bargain. I got four of these. These were actually a pound each. I know that for sure. Um, so these two are, you've got Mexican seasoning shaker. So you can just obviously marinate or just pop it onto the food you kind of want to eat straight away. This one is the peri peri one. Um, so you've got those two. They were, I say, a pound each. I thought that was a jolly good price because you've got does it say 315 grams in each of those and then again for a pound um, same thing again Caribbean jerk style season shaker and the Cajun season shaker so if you like sort of like your spices like we do spicy food and that perfect for a pound 
got this um, 1001 carpet fresh. This is for the bedrooms because obviously I don't have carpet downstairs anymore. But when I used to, I used to use this um, just to keep the, you know, with having dogs and everything, keep it a bit fresher. 1001 carpet fresh, quick drying, fine foam, eliminates odours at source. And this is blush, pear and blossom. That one was, oh, that one was £1.99. Uh, just some Coleman's English mustard. £1.49 for the mustard. Got some dog shampoo. This is especially for Teddy, really, because he's got like, you know, long hair around his bottom, and sometimes, yeah, we have to give him a nice bath. Um, this is pet care, and it's share and honey. Two in one shampoo and conditioner. Smells lovely, vegan friendly, but I always water down, dilute any shampoo that I use on dogs anyway. It does not need to be full strength. Um, that one was four pounds, that one, but there is a lot. It lasts forever. 500 mils in there, and it smells lovely. Um, Some more of this, I swear by this, so it's the Dr. Beckman Pet Stain and Odour Remover. Um, the only place we have, as you know, carpets now is on the stairs, well, literally the whole of upstairs, so if there's any accidents up there, we do use this, I swear by that. And that was uh, £3.19, which was a brilliant price. Got these microfiber cloths. I'm going to keep two by for sort of like mirrors and sort of windows, that sort of thing. But there's four uh, microfiber cloths here. They were just a pound. Uh, two ninety nine. I've got a new shower mat for the to put in the bath because we've got an over bath shower. It's not as big as the one that we've currently got. I don't think, although it is quite sizable. But our other one, it's 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 given up the ghost. It needs to go. Um, so one of those two ninety nine. Uh, some showers plain non breads, there's two in there, which is enough for the three of us. £1.50. These were pound the slow cooker liners. I do still have a whole pack left, um, but I get through these so quickly once the winter comes. So I thought I'd just keep on top because I've just used the pack, so I've replaced it. Green tea, £1.25 for the Tetley green tea tea bags. Uh, there's 20 in there. And then we've got some of the Sharwoods poppadoms. These are the garlic and coriander ones for the curry. I've already got chicken in the freezer. So these were, they were £1.50. Um, what else did I get from there? Oh, yeah, hold on. Um, we did get a dishwasher cleaner. This is the Fabulosa one. Uh, lemon sherbet, I bet that's going to smell good. That one was uh, £1.49. Um, got one of these, so this is the flash dust magnet, the starter kit. So I have already got one of these that I use for dusting, but I've got this one specifically to to use on the new blinds because we've just had new blinds put all around the house. And uh, yeah, so I want to keep on top of keeping them clean with a new one of these. So that's going to be specifically for the blinds, that one. Um, and they were, uh, that was 2 99 uh, These LED candles, were three pounds each so i got two of those and they're three pound each and they've got like the moving i've got quite a few of these now but they're like the moving wick to them um and i got those because i managed to find two new um like candle holders they were reduced in the sale to 125 each so here we are they were originally 250 and they were 125 so i wanted some that were shorter than the ones that i've already got so i can have them a little bit staggered in height so that's those two um right i think oh there's a couple more things to show you 
Um, I'll get them now. These are so cute. I have to make sure that Teddy and Elsie don't see them. These are seven pounds each though. I've got them as their Christmas present to put away and they squeak and all the rest, but I can't let them see them because they want them. So look at the little faces of the octopus. Look at the little red eggs. And they're like the noisy ones and they squeak. They are going to love them. So I saw them and thought, they are going to be just absolutely lovely for their little Christmas presents. They're going to love them. Um, so I'll get them now so I haven't got to think about those in the future. And then what else have you got? Oh, Marks and Sparks. Oh, what's this one? Chris went to Halford, so he got this. Um, this was £7. <laughs> it's quite expensive. Seven pounds, but it's the old fashioned traditional horn. So, for Christmas for Hetty, the youngest grandchild, um, she Chris is making her like a sensory board and uh, <laughs> so cute. We're gonna drive Hannah around the twist. Marks and Spencer's. There's my receipt for that. Jollies for the dog food. Uh, this came to... They're 5 99 each, these guys, anyway, for their dog food. Um, and they're the... Um, they're the JR range, and they're pure salmon pate. This one is the chicken. And then we've got the wild boar flavour one. And they are all, like you know, completely natural foods. So that's those. Well, this was, we went to Costa's and we had a maple hazel hot chocolate and a maple hazel muffin in there. Um, Marks and Spencers, here we go. Marks and Spencers, we've got lime pickle, because I couldn't get that in b and so I got it in Marks's. Lime pickle because Chris really likes that. Um, that was two pounds. We got some mint crumbles. These are Chris's favourite favourite mints. They are one pound seventy five. They're the mints that like are really soft and crumbly. One seventy five. Um, some luxury hot cross buns, which seems a bit weird, doesn't it? But uh, they were two pounds. Yeah, they were. They were, they were two pounds. Um, and that's everything, that's everything we could get today when we popped it out. So um, I'm absolutely shattered now, to be fair. Um, yeah, that's it, my loves. So, I'm gonna love you and leave you. I hope you've enjoyed just watching my little, this little haul. I mean, it's not loads here, is there? But you know, I like to share bits because you never know, you might be interested in grabbing spices say for example you know if you were doing like a little hamper for somebody for christmas i know i'm saying that word but it's not wrong now you could like do a if they like really spicy food you could do maybe a hamper with different spices and rices and all stuff like that you know some some nice if you're going to do go down a chinese route or something you could get some nice Chinese beer or Indian beer or all those lovely things that you could put in a hamper for somebody, especially if somebody you just don't know what to buy for, but you know they like their spicy food. I mean, you could put things like um, tacos in there, all sorts of stuff so that they can like make a lovely meal. Um, but yeah, especially if you get non-perishable stuff, you know, it's like beautiful. Um, just a little idea and something I might actually take my own advice and do. But yeah, that's it then, my love. So if you have enjoyed it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. That goes a long way to help on my channel. And subscribe if you haven't done so already. I'd love that. And of course, press the notification bell so then we can keep in touch with each other. Stay safe, everyone. Take care of yourselves. Talk to you in the next one. Bye for now. Bye.